So what's up guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Dave Richmond, and I created uh, Whitetail Obsession Outdoors roughly five years ago or so. And um, the first two years, I didn't really take it uh, super serious and, because I didn't know how it worked and I didn't know really uh, what it can actually turn into. So over those years, you know, I've learned, you know, a pretty good bit about YouTube and, and how it works. So today's video I want to talk to you about actually there's because i've been getting a lot of questions i just got one a couple minutes ago from instagram but there's a lot of folks asking um how to start a youtube channel or they already have a hunting channel but it's not growing and again i want to start out by saying that i'm not an expert at growing a youtube channel i'm just giving you my experiences from going from zero being stuck at 58 subscribers for two years and then jumping up to i think we're almost at 19 or 20 something like that a thousand you know, uh, subscribers. Um, so in those first two years, um, I didn't know what to do. Didn't know how YouTube works. So I started researching it, started figuring out what diff, what, uh, you know, niches were like a specific niche, um, in that area. Um, I started figuring out what SEO was. SEO is search engine optimization. I started figuring out what evergreen content was. Evergreen content is content that never dies. So, you're creating SEO, you know, titles and um, uh, descriptions and and people or titles that people are actually searching for, content that people are actually searching for through YouTube because you have to understand that YouTube is a search engine. So let's jump right into it. I'm going to give you some ideas. Uh, probably a boring video for majority of you guys because not everybody has a YouTube channel, but. I, I want to put this out there. I think I do one of these like once every year or every other year or something, but the question keeps popping up. So let's jump into it real quick. I'm going to show you how uh, YouTube works real quick. So we're going to bring up a screen here and I've already punched in a title here. And if you look at it, it says how to create a food plot for deer. And if you, um, you know, search real quick, what comes up? Well, that that's an ad, so you really don't want to look at that. Well, then you start scrolling down. You got, you know, a couple different videos. Here's one of mine. You keep going. You keep going. You got another one right here. Uh, a year ago, you have another one here for me. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. And you got all these different types of videos uh, in this uh, search result, which you got another one here from three years ago. Um, I mean, you can just keep on going. You got all these different types of videos. Another one right here from two years ago. And you, you keep going through. And when somebody searches this in the search result, okay, this is the videos that pop up. So, for instance, you, again, you have to consider making videos around these topics. So, if you erase that, and let's say you want to create a, a video on let's see uh food plots in the woods so you're a video maker you want to create a video you go to youtube because you're getting uh title results you're getting uh, ideas of, of videos to make that people when you search into the search bar here and youtube auto generates titles that's titles that people are actually searching for on YouTube. So let's, let's just type it in. Food plots for deer in the woods. You know, this is titles. This is what people are coming to YouTube and searching for. Now if you start to back that up, it gets more, more broad. You know, food plots for deer in the woods. Planting food plots in deer in the south. Food plots. Fall food plots for deer in the south. Best fall food plots for deer in the south. How to make a food plot for deer in the woods. How to plant a food plot for deer in the woods. All these different types of things is what people are searching for. Okay? So you want to create content around that. That way it helps YouTube uh, determine what your video is about and it can distribute to the, to the right people. So... When you're creating these types of searches um, or videos, you know, how to make a food plot in the woods, 
That's called evergreen content because that content is not going to die. There's always going to be people searching for videos on how to create uh, food plots in the woods. So you have to create videos around those titles and with your descriptions, your tags, you know, you want to create um, descriptions that are SEO specific. So if your title is, you know, how to create a food plot in the woods, you know, you want to take that same description and put that or title and put that in your description to, to your, all you're trying to do is help YouTube determine what your video is about. So when you are, when you are first starting out here, let's do another one. So when you're first start starting out making videos, you gotta be search specific, um, to kind of grow your audience. You want to be regular, you know, with videos. If you know, if you want to put out one video, two videos a week, my recommendation is to put out at least one video a week. If you can put two to three videos out per week, um, you know, more is not better necessarily, but you, you also have to be consistent with it. So, you know, you want to, you know, get right to the video. You want to give people, um, the answer they're looking for, because there's always a problem, right? YouTube is that answer for most people. You know, when they have a problem, what do they do? They go to YouTube, how to replace an alternator on your car, right? All this stuff pops up and this is where people find it. So you have to create content around those search, uh, search specific titles or things that uh, that people are searching for. So hopefully that helps guys be consistent with it. Um, it's not real rock and science, but just it's with anything in life. Do your research, you know, put some effort into it. Try to grow, learn SEO, learn evergreen content, be regular, be consistent and deliver uh, educational message to people that's looking um, uh, for answers. So hopefully that helps guys. Any questions, post them down below. I'll see you guys on the next video.